Welcome to my channel. Thank you for coming. Thank you for watching my videos. Thank you for your support. I really do appreciate it. More than you'll ever know. I have been spending the past few weeks, I guess now, watching video after video after video of what's going on in North Carolina. There is a special reason for that. My wife is a North Carolina native, and we, we have a special place in our hearts for that state. And so what happened in Western North Carolina has struck us deeply. And in all of my watching, uh, I have come across a channel called the Appalachian Channel with John Ward, which has impressed me greatly. I'm going to put a link to it in the in the description of this video and I hope that you'll consider subscribing to John's channel. Um, John features Appalachian, North Carolina and Tennessee in his videos but since the hurricane and all the damage that it's done he's been doing what I would call human interest stories about what's happened to individuals who have been hit by the storm. And in the process of doing that, uh, he started featuring a song on his channel. And that's what I'm going to play for you. Um, the name of the song is Helene. And... Um, I don't even know who the singer is of the song. <laughs> Isn't that something? But the song just struck me because the words are so powerful and they're so meaningful. And I think they just really relate to, they really communicate what went on and what's continuing to go on in North Carolina. So that's what I'm going to do now is play that song for you. Before I do that, I want to remind you that I always put the links to the artists in the description field of my videos. I'll put the link to this channel in the description for the example. And I also put a link to the request form so you can request reactions if you want to. I do not take requests from the comments. So you can mention songs in the comments, but I'm not going to react to them. You have to fill out the request form. If you're not sure how to do it or you have trouble doing it, just let me know and I'll do it for you. So without further ado, this is the, Lapp 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 the Appalachian Channel with John Ward featuring the song Helene. <laughs> The gulf's warm embrace We saw your face And it was filled with rage With winds that tore through the night No remorse You left your damage in your reckless course You moved so slow But all oh, the rains they fell The winds they screamed like a voice from hell You took what you wanted Nothing could stand Homes and lives Swept from the land But Helene You can't break the human heart You can't tear apart The love we carry Through the wreckage Through the dark We'll rise again We'll rebuild from the spark You may have taken all we own But you'll never claim our The sunshine state, the peach states, plains But high in the mountains, you brought the pain You erased lives like they were never there Left families in grief, left the world unfair But in the face of your evil winds Something stronger began to begin Yes, you took much, but not what's real the kindness, the love, the human will. But 
Watch what eating. The words of that song are so true. John features, as I mentioned before earlier, uh, he features individuals and he talks, he does what I would call human interest interviews where he talks to people about what's really going on and they tell him the truth. And it's both frustrating and inspiring. And if there's one lesson I think that's to be taken from his videos, it's that if you rely on the government to help you, you're in serious trouble. You have to rely on your fellow man, your neighbor, and, and your people that come to volunteer, because those are the ones who are going to help you, not the government. The government's so full of red tape and, you know, hoops that you have to go through that it's almost impossible to get help, certainly not in a timely manner. So, one of the things that I do now is I pray daily for the people of North Carolina and Tennessee who have been hit so hard that live in the mountains. And for all the lives that were lost, there's many, many more than what they're telling you officially. Uh, I think the official death toll in North Carolina now is about 250, and it's actually closer to 1,000. Uh, I saw stories about uh, people who's, who were carried away by the flood in their houses and of course the houses as they go down the river they fall apart they end up being a big pile of debris and then that pile of debris gets hung up with trees and stuff and it builds a sandbar and the people's bodies are buried in the sandbar they'll probably never be found it's just a really sad sad story uh, I saw a story about one man who they found buried up to his chest in a sandbar and they were working to rescue him and he told them, leave me alone, just leave me alone, I want to die. And they said, no, 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 you don't want to die, you want to live, we're going to save you. And he says, no, I want to die. He says, my whole family is gone, I want to die. And they said, he's, they said to him, well, how do you know your whole family's gone? And you know what he said? They stopped touching my feet three days ago. God, I can't imagine. I cannot imagine. That's just terrible. Absolutely terrible. So, you know, if you're a praying person, please put the people of North Carolina and Tennessee on your prayer list and pray for them daily. They need our prayers. They need God's help because they're sure not getting it from the government. (sighs) 
this is the Vietnam era vet out.